Race seven, Easter Sprint over the 1100 meters was won by number one, Mufasa, the son of Water Winter from the Brett Crawford Yard. Just to mention uh, M. Mtbazi, he's received the 1000 Rand from Hollywood Bets, also to mention Cape Racing, so thank you to them. Mufasa was written by Cabello Matsunyani and a lovely lightweight on his back. Cabello, well done for the win. Thank you very much. Um, it was a very nice win. With regards to this horse, Barry was just mentioning he's such a, a lovely and, and easygoing character. Did he give you a, a lovely ride to, or to the start and the pens, etc.? Yeah, she's the best ride ever. He's got the best nature. You know, he, going down, he actually get, got me worried a little bit. He went down a little bit lethargic and as if his mind was in tune to race. But as soon as those gates opened, he was game. And um, in the finish, he just fought on very gamely. Talking about the finish, it was quite a close contest. Did you think he'd be able to get his head up? To be honest, I, I didn't think he will. But when Mr. Cobbs came to join me, got that carriage to actually fight him off, and he fought on very gamely. I feel, look, as, as presenters, we've loved watching these horses, and you obviously get the honor of, of rounding them. But it's such great and strong racing. You must be enjoying this this level. Yes, um, it, it's, it's very nice, and I have been enjoying it. Um, it comes with its challenges and its ups and downs, but we take them uh, with a strong uh, punch on our chin, and we carry on. And it's been working out, it's been a success, and I'm grateful for every uh, opportunity I get. With regards to Cape Town, it, it seems like it's your, your second home now. Have you enjoyed not only the, the summer, but uh, heading into the winter, um, being associated with Crawford Racing? Yes, um, uh, being associated with uh, Crawford Racing, it's an honor, and it's um, an opportunity that I can put you out there. And I mean, coming down from Sir Crawford also opens up uh, doors with other trainers, and I can be able to get more rides from them. And, if I just carry on doing well and keep producing, um, I have no doubt that I'll definitely make it in Cape Town. Well done for the win. Thank you very much. And once again, to Mr. Crawford for the opportunities. Big thanks to him, to the owners, Mr. Venners. Well done to them. And to my sponsors, Uniform, big thanks to them. Well done. Thank you. There you go. That's uh, Cabello, just uh, to mention uh, all the owners involved, a whole host of them, including the Breeders' Main Chance Farms. Barry's going to come across and, and chat to me, and uh, Barry thankfully spoke to me before the race. Barry, we were just talking off air, what a lovely natured horse uh, Mufasa is. Yeah, I know, top class. <laughs> lovely horse to work with. I mean, he carries himself so well, he's got such a good nature. Um, he's actually, as, as Cabela said, he's quite laid back in the race. It was only when Mr. Cobbs came to join him that he really took off again. Um, yeah, no, super win. I want to say well done to, to the owners, to Lawrence Werners, Harry Wilson, Main Chance, and the rest of the partners. Well done to the team. Um, not easy to win three in a row, um, but he's gone the right way, and let's hope he goes on from here. Well done for the win, Barry. Thank you very much. There you go, and uh, Barry representing Crawford Racing, uh, often uh, um, uh, Brett adds on, uh, they're sponsored by Interbet, so well done to them. I hope I'm not mistaken. But number one, Mufasa, son of Water Winter, Main Chance Farms, breeding this uh, unbelievable, uh, well natured horse. And well done to all the connections. Uh, I know Barry mentioned a host of them, but also to mention Wilfred, um, Wilfred Purzel. Cabello winning a lovely Easter spirit on uh, what's turning out to be a, a wonderful and fantastic horse. A great race to watch. So well done to all the connections. Number one, Mufasa is your winner.